Sounds on. Okay. We have Ivy here, pretty girl. Uh, she smiles. She wants to. She pulls her lips. <laughs> She's a good girl. She made the journey up from the Cape with Betty and Drew. Hi, Bentley. Hi. I know. Oh, no. Yep. I smell like your arch enemy. Uh-oh. He's all over me. <laughs> you smell like the girl. I know. I smell like both of them. I was holding them oh, both dear. together. Bentley, forget it. <laughs> I know. Very exciting stuff. Bentley. You can't. <laughs> forget it. I know. <laughs> oh. no. Oh. Oh, it's terrible. <laughs> He's a no. good boy. No, it's not going to work right. No. <laughs> Like yeah, no. no, we um, had fun with, um, do you want to talk to our tapper? Um, we had fun today, Walter and Noel tied up, so that's good. We got 12 minutes on them, so hopefully um, we'll do it again tomorrow and then the next day and get it all covered. So, Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> um, let's see. All the dogs got out up top today, so, um, and all the pokies got out. So we had, who did we have up top today, Devin? Who's? Um, Wilbur, Dippy, yeah. Cadet, Orville, Pilot, Kara, Regina, and Kara. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, and then all the pokies got out today, so that was good. Everyone did well. Is the big package next to Carlene? Is that a big package next to Carlene? Those are actually, um, Two Coranda beds sent from Tina Shonk. So, thank you, Tina. They have an envelope with them, so I'm sure there's some note Carlene can read at mail call, which is very exciting. Can never have enough of those. We like those ones because the rain goes through them and doesn't pool on top of them. Right. <laughs> right. Which is nice. I want to know if she sewed these or she ordered them. What happened? We'll find out. Now that the weather's nicer and it's lighter out, will the pups get more activity in the evening they seem they seem to out in the kennels more they seem to out in the kennel uh yeah they get all we um when the weather's nice like this we shut the gates and leave them out there a little bit longer so we can give the inside cleanings a little bit more of a scrub down so it's really the perfect temperature right now because it's not too hot and it's not too cold so it's ideal right now um we try and get dogs out in the pond um a field honeymoon hill v pen Flatfield, Puppy Hill, Arena, and Donkey Hill. So if you do it right, and then if you shut the gate and keep two down, you can get out a lot at once, <laughs> which is really nice. And then usually after feedings, um, I'll try and lock everybody out from like 4 to 4.40. So just to try and get them all to poop outside. So everybody says hi, Betty and Ivy. And yay Hello. about Walter and Noel. Dryer and washer are doing well. Um, the spays and neuters went smoothly. Dryer tried to escape after his surgery and army crawl across the floor. We had to pick him up and carry him back. So that went well today. Tina's on, Carlene. Here she is. I sent the Carandas to Shirley and she put them together and delivered them. Oh. Yeah. So okay. she sent the pieces and they put them together. Okay. Yeah, we love those. Caitlin. Thank you, Tina. It sounded like she bought the pieces separate from Coranda. I, I think that they're all from, I don't really. You can buy them. Yeah. Did you buy all the pieces, Tina, individually? And sew this thing together? And did you, so Carlene wants to know if you hand sewed the green <laughs> thing <laughs> or if it came together. Um, so lovely. It's hey. Um. Give me a, a rope behind you. We're going to get a ride over here. You can be in bed. Yeah, she is. <laughs> Come on over here. Stay over here. Come here. Come on. No. Oh, come on. Come off it. Come on. Good girl. Thank you. Um, let's see. On the DD, Carlene's said Great Danes should not be jogging. Is there a real danger if that happens? Well, I think it all depends on the dog and if it's... How fit. How fit they are. Like you Oscar, get them used to it. Yeah, Oscar um, has... Colleen started him running with her, um, but she started that at a young age, and obviously it wasn't like the full tilt 
mile stretch that they do, it was um, she built up to what they have. So, and Oscar's great. I mean, but he's you saw him yesterday. He's he's a nice structure. But yeah, you can't just take a dog that's never run and just expect it to run five miles. <laughs> you can't take a very young one whose bones aren't really sturdy. You know, yeah, and then ask them to do an awful lot of work. We've had that problem before. Um, boy, is she happy with you? This one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where is Grace? Yeah, Tina. I can't find Grace. Tina bought the XL fabric and we bought the pipes and assembled them. Oh, that's great. See, so that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah, so she bought the fabric and then Shirley bought the PVC pipes or whatever and they did it. That's yeah, great. Who, who sewed them? Coranda sews the green. Are you talking about. I think they did slide. Did she say she bought the. What did she just say? She bought the fabric and sewed it? Tina bought the Coolaroo XL fabric. We bought the pipes and assembled them. So the Coolaroo oh. comes and I think it has the pockets and you slide the pipes oh, so through. Oh, so she bought the Coolaroo already made into beds. She didn't buy it in a fabric store and then sew this. No. I'm trying to figure out who sewed this. Yeah, she thought Tina bought, went to the fabric store, bought the green fabric, and hand sewed it. <laughs> yeah. But I was going to say, my word, she did a hell of a job. <laughs> hey, you know, there are people who do that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I'm not one of them. Um, Kara, no, she's about the same. So, um, she's good when she has um, a, a mission, but when she's just kind of loose running around, it's not. She's not the best. Are you having a hard time over there? No, I'm doing all right. <laughs> um, washer and dryer in the front room, so they'll be there for the night. What else we got? Um, when's GE arrive? What time do they arrive on Friday? That's does it I don't know. They seem to come sort of seven, eight o'clock. I mean, it's you know. Yeah. They're working. I mean, they come in oh, here yeah. and expect to work. That's good. Which is wonderful. Yeah. I'm not ready for them yet. I thought I'd be further along than I was today, but I had to do vet duty. What are you have, What are you trying to get ready for them? I haven't lined up where the fence goes. Oh. I also haven't bought it yet. Mm -hmm. I'm right the road, I should have no trouble. Mm -hmm. Everybody's happy to see you, Betty. Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> it's very exciting. Um, what else can we talk about? Walter Noel. It's very exciting. That's very exciting. I had cookies in my hands. I like threw them in the air. I was so happy. <laughs> I, got, I, I had milk bones in my hands when I went over there, and I was like, they're tied! I like tossed them up in the air. Um, so that was good. Very exciting. So start your 63, 63 days. days. Yeah. <laughs> 63 days from today. That's going to be around Father's Day. Oh, you're right. Yeah, that's when I gave... Yeah, when's Father's Day? June... June. Yeah. June. No, we're on the 20th. May 20th. Ariat was growling, so we're, we're correcting her behavior. 31. By tugging on her leash. That's 51. Tapping her gently on the nose. <laughs> Um, yeah. Yesterday, I read Kenyan of Forty Men. Apparently, some people think this may be an old wives' tale, so I retract. <laughs> I was thinking about that um, when I was pulling them out. I was thinking how you said to cut the chips, and in my mind, it was just if I had a hold of it, I was just going to yank it little, instead of trimming the tip of it off. But you never know. Old wives' tales, sometimes those work. Anything new on Maud? I'm not following Maud. She's a, pushing the other donkey away from the food. That's she all. Is. Yeah. That's the worst I've ever seen her. Yeah. I, yeah. But there are two sources of hay, so the little one could turn around and eat out of the hay bag. I have not been at mail call for a while. What is the big blue thing? <laughs> Smiley? <laughs> Carlene with a blue sweater? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, they're talking, <laughs> they're talking about the grand events behind you next to you. <laughs> Did Betty bring whoopie pies? No. She brought um, homemade bread, which is really good. June 22nd. Thank you, Tina. Did Walter and Noel do their thing without your help? Yes, they did. They don't want me involved at all. It was um, when they were out in the parking lot, they kept going behind the storage, the food storage container, like up 
around the corner. And when, when I'd put them in the laundry building, they'd run around away from me. So when we were outside in the parking lot, they kept going away. So I said to Devin, let's just lock them over here and walk away. So we did, and then it worked. So we'll try again tomorrow. <sighs> Anything else exciting? How many times do you try? Um, we try and time as long as they'll let us do it. So the female will let us know when she's not ready anymore. Very vocally with her sharp teeth. No. <laughs> teeth. Yeah. So that's good. Other than that, I mean, the surgeries went well today. Can't complain about that. We're going Beautiful to try day. And do three surgeries. Okay. Um, <laughs> and <laughs> it's going to be a really nice day tomorrow, supposedly. In the seven seventies. These guys are putting up all that fence. We're good. It will wash the dirt off their Keep bodies. Keep cool. Yeah. I don't know. They worked in the rain last time. I I, I have to say that about those GE people. They worked. Mm -hmm. I mean, they had miserable conditions the second day. Yeah. There were a bunch of women here that 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 were GE employees. They come to, and I had we hadn't tied up the fence all the way around there, and it was cold, sleety rain, and they went and finished it. Yeah. I was very impressed. Good. They're hard workers. Very good. We're going to have mostly fencing, and maybe one group can put together a chicken coop. There were a couple out last night around 10, a, 10 p.m. What is their last call to be outside in the kennels? Uh, they can go out in their runs all night long if they want to. So, Typically, a lot of them go in at 5 and, and rest after, um, but they can go out and bark if they want to. <laughs> Well, we hope they don't go out and bark. Yeah. <coughs> but so. Generally, if you fill their tummies, they'll go ahead and take a nap. There were some right back. Red ones too. Yeah, there were. I went down there and spoke to them after. Well, they started up after you left. Always do. Anyways. What did you say? <laughs> All right. Well, I think that's it then. <coughs> okay. Uh, no, Fiona did the spays and neuters today. <laughs> That's funny. So, yeah, Dr. Land. Washer and dryer are good. We can turn the camera, I'm sure, at some point into the other room so you guys can see them. How long does it take to find out if Noelle is pregnant? Isn't it like you could do an if You could do an ulcer, what, 30 days into it? 30, 25 to 30 days. George says he can feel them sometimes. Mm -hmm. Or we could do ultrasound. Of that he always goes and he says, "Do you want to do it this way or <laughs> that way?" And he points at the machine, and I'm always like, "Both." I don't know. <laughs> well, he's I like, do. Yeah. He doesn't usually charge us for feeling. No, he doesn't. So that's why he's, he'll be like, "This is free." <laughs> <laughs> no, it's funny. All right, guys. Does the full moon affect the dogs? I don't know. People say it does. I don't think it does, but I don't. Know. We're providing lunch for the GE people per camera mark. He's gonna, he's gonna do it. He's gonna so. do it one day, and the next day I don't know what we're doing. Yeah, okay, go. good girl. Thank you. Don't growl at people; it's rude. All right. Okay, I'll go back there now. Yeah. I'll take my water jug. Okay. Right, and go. Yeah. See you later. We'll talk Oh. That's a nice one. I know. We're going to pull it down so you're not going to... Okay. That place is getting crowded. I know. I'm sorry. I'm scared. It's all right. It's all right. No, you know she's scared. Oh, is that it? Back up. Back up. You know, I bet Bailey would like one of those. Yeah, I'd be laying on the hard floor. No, she needs dirt on it. Come here, Ivy. Come on up here and try it out. There you go. You can get her on there, Betty. If she wants to, she's gonna go all around it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that the way? Oh, what, 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 okay. You gotta get rid of that thing on the floor. Come here, good girl. Lie down on it. Oh, that's better than the hard floor. Yes, it is. Oh, it's very nice. What are we doing now? We're doing now. Oh. Stay there. Nine. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye.
Okay. Okay, they brought in some of this stuff, so we'll open that first. And and he gave us a rock. A rock. He got it for. Right. From Cape Cod. And then we have some some guest equipment. Shampoo. And things like that. Ooh, that's, the brush. that's the first airbrush we got. Bunch of toothbrushes. They're good. Okay. We'll put them in here. And and then we'll oh, oh, oh. Oopsie. People aren't supposed to call me very <coughs> Service dog project. I don't Oh, my business qualifies for another two hundred fifty thousand dollars. Awesome. Right. <laughs> okay. Oh, and here we have some dollar nothing. Wow, you must have been watching that one in Georgia a lot. Yeah. <laughs> it's a hell of a story. We can't find the bank. Here's the bank. Yeah. There we go. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. That's a good one. Okay. Well, the next question on the fun fund is that we're going to want to spend money on an ultrasound. That'll be the next question. Everybody's got to figure out what they want to do about that. They're expensive, aren't they? It's $150 or something like that. I'm going to give you these to stay there. There we go. And I got the rock. I have a rock on my desk already. Now I have two rocks. Oh, I didn't do the rest of the mail, did I? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You're looking at me expectantly, I don't have anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, I went to the I went to the vet today. The babysit the dogs, and I see that here's one of the problems. I was going to make monkey fists, uh -huh. and I forgot to bring the equipment <laughs> because I've still got a sign over here that says a four and a five inch. So I'm really getting behind. Maybe I'll try and do that tonight. With special thanks. Happy 19th. Oh, Lisa, thank you very much, Lisa. Lisa Cohn. Enfield, Connecticut. So happy the dogs and volunteers are enjoying the sunny days. It's such fun to watch the great group of pups grow and learn. Thanks for all you do. Well, we have more puppies now hopefully coming as of today. Maybe. We'll get this view. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oh my. Oh my, we got a lot of junk. That's that one. That's that one. There's that one. And this one I they make you open this one because they make it look like a check. So, all right, I'm a sucker. I'll try it. You never know, right? I yeah. don't think. You want to bet on it? No. Fast internet service for twenty nine ninety five. However, they don't really need it. Just Chase National Bank. I had nothing to do with them ever. Fast compared to what? Yeah. Yeah. Here's a charge card. Here's Capital One. Powerful travel rewards. So I don't want to go anywhere, so I'll throw all that stuff out. There we are. Next problem. It was easy. Oh, there's more. A couple more. This is for Draft Horse re Rescue Place. It's kind of interesting. However, we've got our own rescue problem. Kremlin Farm Hell. Well, at they Kremlin Farm is bad. They give you a coin, so let's take the coin out. Put that in the box. That 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 Kremlin deal is not a good one. Kremlin Farm. They they take pregnant mare's urine. That's what the Kremlin stands for. Pregnant mare's urine. And they make some sort of Women's hormones out of it or something? Oh, God. But they, 
you know, if they bred decent horses, they'd have a, a, a market for them. But they don't. They just breed anything to anything. And sometimes up in the horse auctions up in New Hampshire, you'll see 20 or so baby horses run in. They won't know where mommy was or anybody, nothing. And, and they just, you know, just kids, 4 H kids up there try and save them and stuff. But it's, it's a bad thing. It's bad. There is, there is artificial preference, so God damn it, use it. So there. <laughs> Got that? Carlene well, spoken. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Start it with the first page. I think it's decent. They're not giving me much interest. Okay. Over. Over. <laughs> Would like to apply for service dog. Okay, very nice. Okay. Okay, this has to go in the over there. In the Can you get the envelope? That would be better. That's all we got. No Harold and Wanda today? Nope. No Harold and Wanda. But last we knew they were still alive and floating. Okay, who we got here? We have somebody. It's on me. I'm gonna try and get it. Oh, it's from Dayton, Dayton, Ohio. Oh, maybe Jan Clark. How about that? Maybe that's who it's from. Not terribly clear, but it could be it's from Dan Clark. If not, it's from somebody else. Here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. These things. These are kind of nice. Mm -hmm. We're getting kind of used to these because Megan has shamed us into it <laughs> by carrying these so that if a dog goes to the bathroom on the floor, she wipes the floor. What are they, wet wipes? Yeah, Clorox. Well, she she put on such a performance at Costco when the dog moved on the floor that everybody gave her hand and clapped. And, I mean, it was, it was really pretty good. Okay. And here we have... The dollarings. Dollarings. Thank you, Carly and Explore, for allowing CPs to experience a small part of service dog projects. <coughs> Thank you, Jan Clark. I did have the right name. How about that? Hey, there we go. You got it. But look at these. These are good. These, these fit in the, in the side of the dog. Ivy. And here we have a whole bunch of Ivy. Of well done. Nice. Now, anybody on the property is now supposed to have one of these in their back pocket. What we were going to do was take these nice neat tidy mm -hmm. ones and get rid of all the ones that are falling all over the front porch. Mm -hmm. So throw those out and let's put up some good ones and then for heaven's sake, people carry them, please. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What am I going to do with this? Give it a second. Oh, this sounds, this sounds good. Mm -hmm. This sounds good. Terry Miller. Whoa. Whoa, Terry Miller. Ordering from Walmart with the fancy boxes. They're heavy duty boxes. Oh, look at the look at the weight of those boxes. Those are heavy. Yeah. It's like double fun. Walmart. Hey, heavy boxes. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. A whole bunch of things in here. My word. <laughs> Look at the paper. Both milk bone and alpha, both. Wow. Wow. That kind? 
don't have the other kind. We have all kinds. How about that? Oh, it's the wrong way up. Here we go. The way up. These are little bites. Would you like one? Would you like one? Does the sun come up in the morning? Yeah. Here. Hey, Luigi. Come here. Hey. Hey. Anybody else want one? Oh, of course you do. Uh-oh. Did I read oh, did, Could you read it? Yeah. There we go. Yeah. She pulled the blanket in a little bit. Yeah, she did. <laughs> could she have one? Yeah. Bailey? Bailey? There they are. And this one wants one? I think Bailey wants one. Not Bailey. I think Chaos wants one your own way. Yep. Well, sorry, it's Chaos. <laughs> You're going to have to get up. Yeah. Uh-oh. I didn't oh. make it. I can hand one to Chaos. Bentley back up. Bentley. Okay. That's it. Wow, you guys like those. I didn't make it. She didn't like it. Huh? She didn't like it. I don't say that. She didn't understand it. Okay. I, I was supposed to read the thing from Tina. Oh, then. Oh, it's behind you. We'll do that next. <coughs> Where happened to the letter? I think it's on the back of this one. Okay. As long as we get it. Get it, was, it was attached. This is from Donna Kenny. Donna Kenny. Another Walmart box. There we go. Oh, wow. Wow, look at this. Wow. Okay. whole bunch of dog biscuits and some advantage. Oh, wow, look at that. Not, not only do we like these biscuits, we like the jar they come in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Whoop. You want to hear something funny? This afternoon when we were in the guest house, I saw some little dog cookies, and then I said to Drew, oh, there's some mi mixed nuts here if he wants them. And then I looked, and it's like, uh, don't think they're mixed nuts. <laughs> <laughs> so these are, these are a couple of these things in here. Those are little biscuits here. But they like, that Trader like, and everybody likes, including you, right? Wait a minute, maybe I can get some out here. Uh-oh. There we go, we got that one out. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, we like them. Hey, we like them. Riot's attention seems to be elsewhere. Did you get any? You didn't get any? There you go. Okay, that's it. You're done. Everybody go away. You can take this away? Mm-hmm. Okay. That's right. It's getting, getting kind Thank of crazy. You. Okay, from Tina. <laughs> from the Tina. That's a pretty picture. He's a very generously person. Several of these Coolaroo Dame-sized dog bed covers. 
which are no longer made with the intent of them being made into dog beds for service dog practice. The plan was for Tina to be at mail call in person today to present these to you. Unfortunately, she had to cancel her trip. However, at least the beds made it, and Tina will be able to view them on camera like everybody else. <coughs> they are wonderful. Why are they no longer making those cooler Rodane sized dog bed covers? I don't know. They're very nice. And furthermore, that's the one kind that Bailey can get on because she doesn't slide. Mm -hmm. The ones that are solid, that collect the water, she can't get on because she slides around. But these are good. They're very nice. Thank you, Tina. See if you can find any more. That's wonderful. You can tell us where. Okay, we did that. And we've got one bed here in the middle of the floor. Do you want to pull the yellow one out with the curtain on it or something and show everybody? That, those are very nice. Those are super. Mm -hmm. For heaven's sake, people should not sleep on them. <laughs> yeah. Reinforce up the center like that. FedEx just came. FedEx? Oh, oh that's ahead. my package. Ah. Mm -hmm. There'll be a slight delay while FedEx arrives with the next batch. Okay. You wrote Tina down somewhere. Yes. Okay, so we'll put this over here. Uh, nice material. My word, we got paper. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I was going to try and straighten it out and roll it up, but it doesn't... not in the car. There's a lot of paper here. I mean, I was going to say, that's a lot of paper for your boxes. I give up shredding it up. <laughs> <laughs> um, they often write to me and ask me what I thought of their packaging. Uh -huh. Put it in the nearest dog. Can you burn that in the fireplace? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Don't stop now. <laughs> I thought it was making too much noise. No. We have to wait for the package to get here from FedEx. Here it comes. Yeah, that's mine. <laughs> wow. This is good. Wow. Okay. These are from you. Yeah, go get for me. Okay. Drew and I are addicted to them. Oh. The blueberry ones are delicious for breakfast. Really? Yeah. Oh, they're so good for breakfast. I'm going to get the potato. Oh, you want me? I'll get that, Bailey. Let me get that, please. There you go. Okay. I've had the conventional. Grogi. Potato and onion and cheese. There's a um, potato and onion, potato and cheese, and there's um the the cabbage and potato and cheese, and there's prune and there's potato and cheese with kibasi, blueberry. No, but and that's the brand they sell. Right. Wow. Wow. Do I know these? Have I had these before? I don't know, but so. they're delicious. I don't think so. What's her problem? Is she oh. She might want, yeah. You want a different bed, ben, Bailey, Bentley, Bentley? I think she wants the other bed. You want to swap over? Come over here, Bentley, come. You want to come over here and lie down? Go there and lie down. Go. No, go over here. Come on, Bentley. Go there and lie down. Come on. Bentley. Oh, you Bentley. Go. Bentley. Go. Up there and lie down. 
Get a good boy. Get up there. There we go. Now we'll go back to worrying about these. We're gonna, I'm going to need help here. I'm going to make that what we're going to do. I'm going to hold this bucket down. You get it out. Maybe. There we go. Okay, we got that. Okay. We have to do this again. here. Oh my word. Questions? They're frozen. Oh yeah. Okay. They're frozen too, so you need to thaw out like a package if you want it in the morning. Huh? They're not. They're not frozen right now. Yeah, they are. I, that is okay. Take your word for it. They're supposed to come frozen. <laughs> we'll eat them. You watch. <laughs> yeah, you they, watch. They probably won't last long. Okay, so I'm going over here and you're going over there. There. How about that? I'll go over here. Okay. Did she get that two months the other day? That's what you got up here? You have to get the other dog out of there. And, and in a while she'll get up and she'll stare at him and you got to move him back. <laughs> she goes back and forth. Musical beds. Yeah. What do you got? What? I know where I was. Okay. Do, 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 do. Uh. Mm -hmm. Too far? Oh, there we go. Okay. How close is the neighbor's house? Oh, my. Okay. Um, the closest neighbor here is probably 200 feet out the front mm -hmm. driveway. Sort of. Yeah, there are people all around the perimeter now. There are, yeah. Much. Well, except this is all Willowdale State Forest. Right. Who is the overnight person? I don't know. Melissa? Melissa. On sleepless nights, I have watched Bailey lick that paw at great length. It's not her paw she's licking. Right, it's the chin. She's, she's rubbing her chin, which is oozing a little bit, and then she wipes the ooze off her paw. 
See? See, mm -hmm. See what she just did there? She scratched her chin and then she licks the paw. Carlene, have you tried the ultrasound machine that was donated? We have, and we are fooling with it, and we can certainly fool with it with this bunch, but I don't know how to use it. Uh, pay, uh, Paula does, mm -hmm. and she's complained with it. We should play with it with the donkey. <laughs> So it said the pups in town are pulling a very sharp looking piece of wood down in the kennel. Can someone go check so they are not wrong? What? Okay. Okay. I wonder what they're doing. Ivy has decided that the bed is perfect. What a good girl. <laughs> Those are nice beds. I yeah. like that. I like that material. Grace is in the other room. Grace is in the infirmary. The riot's not allowed in the infirmary, so the riot's upset. <clears throat> and Bentley is trying to sit on my lap. <laughs> okay. A lot of comments about the dogs chewing on the wood. Is Kara getting better with Carleen yet? Kara, Kara isn't oh. in here. <laughs> Not even in here. Kara has been returned to the kennels. I tell you who I'm making progress with is Ruby. Oh. Ruby wouldn't come near me. Really? Yeah. But now she does. She doesn't run away. Okay. We're, we're getting to be good friends. I think maybe it was the beard. <laughs> Can the patients, patients in the sunroom have to a get cookie? Up there. <laughs> he wants to get up there. The pillow's in the way. Uh -huh. could, you, could you go move the pillow? Oh. Go ahead, Bentley. Go that way. Call him. They're wondering if the uh, patients in the sunroom can have a cookie too. No. Probably not right now. That's up to Graves. Yeah. Good to see Bailey paying attention and wanting treats. How many cakes were delivered? I don't know. Like I, every once in a while, I hear somebody delivered a cake, but I, I didn't get, I didn't get the total. We have no official, no official count yet. We gotta count all those hanging chads. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I want to buy the same bed. I want to buy that same bed for my grand dog. Where do I find it? After talking to Tina, I don't know yep. where she got it. To Tina, they say they don't make them anymore. The fabric. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. On the internet, you can always find something. Anything on the internet, it seems, even if it's not made anymore. These are good because you leave out in the rain and the rain doesn't puddle. Right. Probably dry pretty quick, too. It'll get wet. <coughs> Who, what are, or is GE? General Electric. The General right. Electric Company. They make they make airplane engines or right. something. Very big plant. <coughs> big they? outfit. They're in Lynn, I think. Yes. Yeah, down in Lynn. They take up half the town, I think. Well, they have quite a community service program. They do a lot of stuff. Yep. It's surprising how many companies are doing that now. I know. We're getting calls. Mm -hmm. Because awesome. we are an interesting one. <laughs> yeah. Awesome job, Tina, Shirley, and Gary, too. <laughs> so it said, put it in the nearest dog, LOL. Put it in the nearest dog? Yeah, they're laughing at it. Oh. Nice to see Betty.
Someone says, somehow the sound of them drinking water makes it sound delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey, especially. Oh, so it says the um, pierogies are great with pesto sauce. Oh, okay. Oh, fried onions, a little sour cream too. Fried onions, uh, fried onions sounds good. What are they anyway? They're 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 a, a dough, a, a spaghetti dough type thing. What is it? What are they made of? It's just a uh, a dough, a dough, and then mm -hmm. the filling inside is. Whatever. Whatever. I think yep. I got you potato, onion, potato and onion. Blueberry. Potato and cheese and blueberry. Yep. Yep. Sounds wonderful. They are. They're really. I have to try the blueberry in the morning. <laughs> they have good. a pound of butter, right? Okay. Yeah, I like a lot of butter. I'm sure of it. Makes them really crispy. <laughs> so it said, is she from Parma, Ohio, pierogi capital? Nope, they're yep. from Chicopee, Mass. Chicopee. But you're not from Palmer, Ohio. No. No. Oh, good. Oh. Dinner's here. Are they delivering yet? Yeah. Oh, good. People want to know if Drew is here. Huh? Mm -hmm. yeah, yes, Drew is here. Are they here? Yeah. Oh, good. They're here. You did what? Not put a tip on the order. Let me. Linda K says 30 cakes have been delivered so far. They're, oh, good. Wow. That's, that's a good amount. What helps you relax before going to bed, Carlene? Brandy. Brandy. <laughs> Brandy. I'm the only one allowed to drink on the property. Are any of the Danes pregnant? Maybe. Maybe. I need to get some tip out of here. Oh, God. You didn't get too organized. Oh, someone's wondering what the clear span building you were talking about in the Look Daily Doggy is for. A 10. Oh, yes, I have ten. Put them back over there. The clear span building. Uh, the arena is clear span, mm -hmm. and so is the G10. Mm -hmm. And I'm just thinking that we ought to have another one. Okay. Want to stuff those back in there? Come on in. For what? Oh, that. Why, hey, chaos. Hey. Stop this riot the because there. she can't hear me. <laughs> oh, stop it! That's riot. People are wondering if there is sound on the donkey cam. I think there can be. There can be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How much does Bentley weigh? 165 pounds. About as much as me, almost. Do you want to go ahead and turn the camera now? Yep. Yeah. Okay. All right. We can say good night. 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 Good night.